Hi friends, welcome back or welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Cynthia and I thank you for clicking on this video here. So we have my April empties, which honestly is not a full month of April. This is more like almost three weeks because of the way when I filmed the last video. And I told you in the beginning of that video that it was like the March uh, empties. It was more like six weeks worth or like a month and a half. So anyways, let's get right into it. I just want to get through it so we can start the fresh new month of May with empties. And I will show you at the end of the month uh, or beginning of next month what we have. But let's go with the candles first since they're on top. Gingham Gorgeous. I actually really, really enjoyed even this one wick. I use this one in my hallway uh, bathroom and I just really enjoy this scent. I love it in the three wick. I really like it. I mean, it is obviously a lower thrower, but it wasn't something that I couldn't smell at all. And I liked this peony flower. So it is like a sweet fruity floral, but definitely I can smell the peony. I like this one a lot. So um this one right here is super strong it is you're gonna see the inside it's super sooty because yesterday i finished it off and i just left it on like the whole afternoon and i guess that was pretty bad so i actually had to clean the jar because it was so sooty and i don't like seeing that it's, it was just really gross but you see that yeah it's really gross <laughs> um either way i love this scent so i think I'm going to say if you don't burn it for way too long of a time, you know, you just go by like three hours or maybe at most four, uh, you will be fine. But I really loved smelling the scent. And yesterday, like I said, afternoon, I finished it off. I turned it on like early afternoon and left it until it was done. So salted grapefruit, mm, really get that grapefruit. Green ocean leaves and bright huckleberry. I don't know about that, but you definitely get the grapefruit. Um, I really did enjoy this one. I do enjoy it. I mean, I have the other packaging of this and I just uh, adore it and I love it. So Here is my three wick of Gingham Gorgeous. Love the packaging. I hated the silver lid, but anyways, <laughs> I really love this one. I'm happy that I still have two in my collection. You know, I might burn one more, hopefully keep one, we will see. I, this is really good. It's not super strong, friends. Like if you put it in your living room, I think it's gonna be more like a six of a throw. It's gonna project just a little bit, not too much. But if you like burning certain scents like in your bedroom, this one was one of those for me. Really enjoyed it in my bedroom. So that it was, it, it filled it up pretty well. Like it moved to like about, I would say a seven or an eight. That's not bad at all in my room, in my opinion. So love it. I love, love, love this scent. This is really good. So here is this ice cream shop. Wanna be ice cream shop because I'm like, that's not what this really was. Limited edition candles, rose water and ivy plus the vanilla bean. I really did like this. Um, this in no way, shape, or form, in my opinion, is rose water and ivy. This is definitely just like a super sweet scent. And um, I just love it. Uh, so this one was more like, I believe Nina said it was the Be Mine candle, something like that, like super sweet. Um, yeah, with that vanilla bean, definitely I could see the sweetness of the vanilla bean but and marshmallow, but I do not smell no rose petals at all. And I mean, I still enjoyed the candle. So maybe I would say the name is deceiving, but I still enjoyed it. I would say for me, this candle was a throw of a six to a seven. Um, it does set out a little bit past the halfway point where the wicks start to drown. And then you have to, if you want to dump a little bit out or cotton ball it, but, and it sets up a little, of course, with the vanilla bean, just burn it for less time as Nico has told us. So maybe tops two hours, but of course I sometimes went three. I still really like this one and I still have two more. So happy Easter. And I finished this one off, I mean, completely. And then I was burning or not burning it, put it on a warmer. That's why the wicks are on the side there. Cause they actually end up moving once you put it on a, a plate warmer. And I like this one, you know, it's not like a complete favorite, but when it came to the packaging and Easter coming around, I think I'll always get this. Like Obviously, I think Happy Easter Tutti Fruity Candy will always come around the Easter time and I will continue to buy it. I just am. And it is, I mean, something that reminds us more of champagne toast. So a lot of those people that really love champagne toast, 
that's probably why they do it because you know what it sells out so <laughs> there is that one now another favorite that this is from the bake shop collection from a couple of years back iced blueberry biscotti look at this jar this jar this was the first collection that i personally bought every single one of because i wanted to just have this and i just really love this one so we have sugared blueberries sweet vanilla ice icing almond biscotti and brown sugar this is such a sweet blueberry scent it is so good to me this one throws like it gives me i would say like an eight um i don't know if other people have experienced it differently but i do have a friend that we experience it the same where it just it throws we love it i want to open it and smell it again hold on um you do have to be careful again with this one as well for it to soot but it wasn't really bad i don't remember cleaning the jar actually i don't think i did but i mean you can see a little bit of soot there so there is that one i love this one i hope i think i have at least another one in my collection that's one of the things that when i have the last one i don't want to burn it but i truly enjoy this scent like burning it and oh my gosh i hope they bring it back but we have this is my second um cocoa paradise that i burn because i mean you know if you watch any of my videos you know i love cocoa paradise and i love coconut scents so uh, salted coconut manoy sugared neroli bronze sandalwood this one is a good one to me it burns around seven to eight as well um and coconut scents are just really really good to me and i just love them and i will buy more of this one if i could find it at sas i will buy more because i in truly enjoy it like so so much that i definitely want more of that one so let's see another tutti frutti candy because i you know around basically for easter i was burning these so did i say yeah because i hope i did say it was april uh i'm like getting lost with my months i hope i did say that it's april empties but anyways um yeah so i burnt this one there's always a lot left with like these single wicks so that's just the way it is let me see this one seems like it burnt down a little bit more so it looks like unless i find something at the bottom of this like six three wicks is all that i burned in the last like i said about three weeks and then two single wicks the single wicks are some of the ones, if I burn two, like I'm happy. If I burn three in a month, I'm happy because I'm really bad at kind of bringing them out. And when I do have them out, like I'll have them in my bathroom, like I forget to turn them on in there. So that's a point that I'm trying to make to myself to make sure that I do that. Now we have this raspberry green tea soap. So I finally used this one up. I say finally because I've had it for a while now. And those are the notes. It's good. I mean, nothing extraordinary and um i liked it so we also have look if you saw my soap haul my hand soap haul, uh haul that did i say <laughs> okay if you saw my soap haul you saw that i bought two more of these i love this one again if i find more at sas i will buy them ice lemon pound cake is just so so good and i really do love this one so there is that so there's that one and then friends this one is part of my project use it up just because i've had but this butterfly shower gel for a while that's why i brought it out so i can use it up not because i don't like it i do love it um but i just needed to bring things that i've had in the collection for a long time and i want to use them so this one is part of that i hope that i don't forget to just dump it out and put it in the other bin so when i go through the products that i'm you know put, that i have put in my project use it up but last last empties and i said that and i ended up throwing about all of it away so that i will have to tell the story in the project use it up video and i think this one is part of it too black cherry merlot did i take that maybe i left it in here i'm a little confused with that so please forgive me also, did I show you Beautiful Day body cream? I might have. So <laughs> I need to separate things. So we have Aqua Fresh Cavity Protection. You guys know this is the one we use for brushing our teeth. So there is that. And then my husband used up this Birch and Eucalyptus. So this one I had got at one of the SAS. Um, I think the last one actually. And so he used this one up. Um... 
cucumber melon so here is that one i really do love this uh dove soap and you guys just know if we love the scent as long as it's dove we love it so we have another project use it up and this is a lotion this was um, raspberry jam donut and i just had a little bit left for a long time that i basically just wanted to polish it out and finish it and then the Olay, and this is the face cream that my boys and my husband use. I use it sometimes when I run out of whatever I've bought for myself. So yeah, I definitely sometimes use that as well. And then I used up, this is from Project Use It Up as well. I was spraying this on myself among whatever else, as long as it was sweet uh, on myself. So I would spray this one on top just to finish it off. So I really do like this Happy Easter Sweet Bunny Berry. I mean, not like a complete favorite, but I like my sweet scents, so I liked it. Uh, we have, this one is like a favorite, Gingham Fresh. This Gingham Fresh body scrub, I really loved and enjoyed. Definitely look forward to buying some more at SAS. And I keep saying SAS because you guys already know June, I believe June 13th, which is around the corner next month. Crazy, right? Crazy how time flies. Makeup removers. These are some that I use obviously to take off the first part of my makeup. And then I go in and wash it and all of that. So we have these wipes that we use a lot of, but I only put a couple in here. Equate. Um, these are the wipes I grabbed from Walmart to use. And we have this Dove Shea Butter. Uh, next, we have this Dove Shea Butter Bar Soap Empty Box. This one I used up because my boys, this one doesn't have a lot of scent, so they don't care for it. And, and it's because of that, I think. So they don't really care for that one. I've been told not to buy this one again. If I buy it, I'm going to have to use it up. So anyways, here's a second one. These are my last ones. I don't think in the next month that I'll have any more of those. And then, of course, because it was the Easter month, we have this gel Tutti Frutti candy soap. I, this one I had used up in the kitchen. Um, happy Easter. And I hardly get gel soaps. When I do, I do end up putting them in the kitchen. And then we have Watermelon Mojito. This is one of the newer from the top Tropical Collection that came out this year uh, that I used up uh, recently. So we still, in three weeks, like I said, use up a lot of soaps. We use up a lot of hand soaps here at this house. Uh, definitely wash our hands very often. My boys do too. So Hip Hop Hooray Cotton. What is it? Hold on. Cottontail cake pop. I couldn't see it right. <laughs> this one here, I love love it because it's really sweet. It's like really that buttercream comes through the cake butter. It's it's just really good. I love this one. Like if I find more of this scent for um, sass as well, I would buy it. So there is that one. I think this one was part of my project use it up. I need to actually myself rewatch that video so I can see what from what i have i need to put away in a different bin because this last time like i said i threw a lot of things out and then at the end i just dumped them back in here trying not to get rid of everything and then as i do my makeup i tell you guys that i use this mario badesco skincare facial spray what i do is i dot like foundation on my face and then i spray this on and then i go in with the beauty blender to like blend it all out i love doing that i don't know that it does anything that's just what i really love to do so here we have an after dark that Austin has been using up. I know I think Alex has been using this one too. But yeah, so there is this one. I know I'll have more body creams. There's several that we have out there that have just a little bit. We just have to finish them off. And then here I finally used up, and not be, I say finally, but because I put it in my project, use it up. I love this scent, Magnolia Charm. I still have a lotion of it, which is good. And I have another full spray. I'm trying to finish off. I didn't put it in the project use it up, but I actually, in my own head, have. Want to use up the spray for it as well. It's just really good. Uh, we have this right here, the Gillette uh, Clear Dry Tech Wild Rain. So here is that. That's the deodorant that my boys use. And of course, you guys know we use the head and shoulders two-in-one um, shampoo basically like shampoo and conditioner smooth and silky so there is that one that we've used up in the last three weeks and we have this we always use Thera breath dentist formulated this oral um, 
rinse. This is the one we use up um, in the last three weeks. Okay, so then I have this little brow benefit, gimme brow, uh, little mini for the eyebrows, like, I don't know what you call it. It's like a brow gel and I've had it for a while. So I finally put it here because I tried to use it and it's dry. <laughs> so I was like, let me just show it to you guys. That's a really good one though, but it's pricey. So, and then this is the last one of these that was in there, but that's all that I have. Like it is not a lot, but you know, I feel like for about three weeks, not bad. And until the next one, my friends, I appreciate you guys so, so much for watching. I thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, night, whenever you're watching. Until the next one, stay blessed. Bye, guys.